Well, good morning, everyone. Pastor Corey Rowan here with Yorksville First Midvale and Newport United Methodist Church, bringing you a devotional today out of the book of Psalm and Psalms 136, beginning in verse 1. It says, Give thanks to the Lord, His steadfast love endures forever. Give thanks to the King of or to the God of Gods, His steadfast love endures forever. Give thanks to the Lord of Lords, His steadfast love endures forever. And it continues on, this psalm continues on repeating the phrase, His steadfast love endures forever. His steadfast love endures forever. The psalmist is trying to reveal to us a wonderful secret. And it shouldn't even really be a secret. It's the message that God's steadfast love, the steadfast love of the Lord, lasts and endures forever. And, and the steadfast love of God is never something that we're going to wear out. It's never something that we're going to use up because it endures it lasts forever. The mercies of the Lord are anew every day. And if you ever doubt that God loves you, all you have to do is look to the cross of Christ. There is no greater act of love than Christ dying on the cross for our sins. God loves you more than anyone else ever could or ever will. And God knows you better than anyone else ever will. You see, the book of Jeremiah tells us that the human heart is desperately wicked, incurably wicked. And it says, who really knows how bad it is? And that's, an, that's a really important question. Think of all the people that love you. Who really knows what we're capable of as far as sin and evil? Really, only God know the, knows the depth of our sin. Only God knows the depth of our evil. And yet the Bible says over and over again that he loves us. And he loves us enough to send his son to die on the cross for us. As Paul said... That Christ died while we were yet sinners. God showed his great love for us that Christ died while we were yet sinners. Church, we serve a loving God. A God who loves us so much that he is willing to give up his son for us. In fact, when I was listening to the band Casting Crowns, I saw them in person. And the, the lead singer was talking about his days in youth group. And he said his youth director was an older man. And the, that his youth director was always trying to get through to them with the message of the gospel. And nothing was ever working. Finally, one day, the youth director told them, told them, I love you all. He said, I love you all. And he said, I love you so much that I would be willing to die for you. He says, I've lived a good life and I would be willing to give up my life if it meant that you guys could live. He said, but if I had to give up my son, you'd all be toast. He said, because there's no way I would ever, ever give up my son for any of you, no matter how much I love you. But then the youth director continued on. He says, but that's how much God loves you, that he is willing to give up his only son to die on the cross for you. And so my message for you today is to know and appreciate the love of God and then share that love with others. Amen.